Yo, what's going on, y'all? It's your boy, man. I have been on a crazy badge hunt. You guys don't understand the work I've been putting in on 2K, man. Bar after bar, attribute after attribute, badge after badge, the hunt is on. And I'm hungry. I want to let everybody know, man, I'm trying to get to 99 so quick, so quick. I want to be one of the first YouTubers to make it to 99. I've been putting in that grind. I ain't sleep. I ain't eat. I'm out here in these streets. You feel me? It's crazy right now, man. The hunt is crazy. But let's go ahead and talk the prayers real quick. Behind every player is a story. Earlier, we caught up with Prez to talk about his story, overcoming the loss of his father. Yeah, you know, after my dad passed away, it was tough. Um, he was always encouraging me to think long term, always pushing me to be my best. And my mom had to support my love for basketball enough for the both of them when he was gone. And uh, yeah, man, I know if he saw me today, he, he'd be proud. I miss you, Dad. But I know you're watching. You better be. Not a crazy bad story, but I just wanted to show you guys one play from this game, man. This game right here was big to me because it's my favorite team, as well as something big happened after this game. And oh my God, the jump shot is cash. Listen, that's the kind of hustle I want to see out of you. From the tip off to the last buzzer, intensity all the way. I like that. So keep that up. Hey, Prez. How you doing, man? Good win, guys. You too, Press. Nice win tonight, man. <clears throat> all right, Press. I've done all the legwork. And as a lottery pick, you're going to have plenty of options. See, these companies, they believe in what you're going to be in the league. And they see your potential. So they want you to represent their brand. Now, let's take a look at the options. Nike wants you bad. See, their plan is to bring you on the team right away with a straight merch deal and put you in a pair of team Nike shoes. Then you'll be one of the faces of the brand leading to your own signature shoe, billboards, commercials, the whole nine. Can't go wrong with the swoosh, baby. <laughs> And right there in the same family is the Jordan brand. I mean, you know you're doing something right. You got MJ on your side. They want to start with a straight merch deal, which puts you in a pair of Team Jordan shoes. And if you continue to rise and go where you're going, we're looking at a signature shoe, billboards, commercials, the whole nine. You know the game, and the game knows you. You know, who better to have on your side than Jordan, right? Guess what it is now. Now this is when it starts to get really interesting. Under Armour is banking on you being part of their team. They want to make you the face of their brand sooner than later. They're talking cash deal, lots of opportunity for bonuses, and a UA team shoe. I mean, this is a real opportunity to get in line with a fast, young, hustling company. Right? What do you think? And let's not forget Adidas. Adidas wants to run with your presidential theme. I mean, pff, God bless America, right? We're talking cash deal, and bonuses. And they want to put you in your very own team Adidas shoe. Then down the line, we can get a signature shoe, commercial, the whole nine. Things can really take off. So I think we go with Adidas if you want to run with your presidential theme and nickname. What do you say? You're Adidas and you? Or Adidas and me? So it's up to you. I mean, I know it's a lot to think about, but... You're in a pretty good position right here. Look, I don't know, Bruce. I feel like this is harder than picking a college, you know? Like, way harder. I, I need a, a spreadsheet to remember all that stuff. Yeah, yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot. But, you know, personally, you can't lose, right? You're in a win-win situation. So it's wherever you feel the most comfortable. And not just on your feet, but as a business partner. So take your time, kick back, relax, think about it, and I just need an answer in about five minutes. Now check this out man, this dude literally pitched me on four different companies, but only two of them is really willing to give me that good man, they willing to give me merch, they willing to give me cash, they willing to give me a signature shoe, and team branding. My man, the presidential thing does sound nice with Adidas, but come on man, Adidas? All day I do dream about sex, but what I'm saying is, I gotta go with Nike, you know what I'm saying? Jordan, I love you, you got the classic shoes, sneakerhead brands, but I could buy your shoes in the my part. We going Nike on the court, let's get it. Great choice.
This is the beginning of big things. Nike is going to be pumped. I hope so, man. Oh. Can't wait to get it started. Fire in the hole. Whew, I feel good about it. Gotta love it. All right, now before we get into the next couple clips of gameplay, I just want to show you guys my endorsements, my contracts, things that's on the board right now. I had to accept that Foot Locker deal, man. I just don't believe Mitchell and Ness can keep up with my swag. You feel me? Don't nobody want to wear throwbacks no more. Now, moving on to sneakers, you already know, man, I'm a Nike branded athlete now. It's time to get these kicks out here. Now, I really didn't know that Nike didn't have as many shoes on the list like they did last year. Now, it's probably because I already got all the Kobe's. So, I'm probably going to be looking more for like Kyrie Irving's, Kevin Durant's. I do want the high top LeBron's. But right now, I just feel like my money ain't there. So, I'm going to go ahead and go with the lesser evil. And that right there is the Kyrie's, man. I seen Cash Nasty wear these at PAX. I fell in love with them, yo. I'm even thinking about getting a pair in real life. Them things look hard. You feel me? I'm talking about hard. Like, I, listen, I'm not a sneakerhead. I do wear basketball sneaks when I play basketball. But when I seen them Kyrie's on Cash Feet, I was like, damn, they Kyrie's? I was like, I didn't even know he came up with a high top sneak. Them things was fire, you know what I mean? Them things was litty, you dig? But making a purchase, you already know, man. Go to Gotta go check out my, my player, man. Um, Just to let you guys know, that little attribute bar screenshot that you guys are seeing within this, that ain't me right now. You know what I'm saying? I'm way better than that, man. More bars on deck. I'm just letting you guys know, this is me like day one of the game. You feel me? I'm talking day one, you dig? It's so crazy here. But listen... This is my Kyrie Irving shoes on a away court, but man, I got to show you some home gameplay. Now, moving into the gameplay, man, as a point guard coming off the bench, every time I come in a game, it's a tightly contested game, but when I get these badges and I go on my hunt, can't nobody stop me, fam. I'm just going to let y'all know that now. Oh my God, I'm trying to tell y'all, the dribble moves this year is insane. Dude is on a wire right now. I got this dude doing like a little yo-yo. Like, you feel me? Right to the rack and one with the left hand finish. You know what time it is, man. Got to go to the line. Got to hit my free throw. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't like the way my, my man just hit me on the shoulder like that. Trying to knock my shoulder out of place. I ain't playing like that. But uh, my free throw is still a weird free throw, man. I still like it, though. You know, I might I might go with Kobe's or I might go with Curry soon enough. But, man, it's 96 to 82. Third quarter, you already know, man. With the left, I'm telling y'all, I go left now. I'm not scared to go left. I feel like nobody can stop me. A plus, you know what I'm saying? Making it do with the do beat my chest. That's how hype you're supposed to get when you play this game, man. If you ain't hype when you're playing this game, something wrong with you. You know what I'm saying? You got to get hype every time. Now, as you guys can see, I got 13, 8, and 7, man. So close to a triple-double. But I will tell you, man, 2K jipped me out of this thing because they subbed me out for the whole fourth. Haters, bro. I promise you. Kevin, thank you. Superb. And now let's move on to the presentation of our Jordan player of the game, the captain. Hey, Shaq here. You guys play with a lot of confidence. But did you think the win would come this easily? Uh, man, I don't really think about games like that, man. I go into each one expecting to give it my all and, and try to get the win. And I expect the same of my teammates. You know, the fact that we won by a lot just means we all put in the effort and basically did what we were supposed to do. Easy as that. Easy as that. Good job. All right, you guys. Now, to end this video off, I wanted to give you guys the biggest tip in NBA 2K17, my career, man. You have to do the vertical jump. That's all you got to do when you go to the practice arena, man. Yeah, man, I'm giving you guys this tip. I know a lot of people want to do the one-on-ones, the two-on-twos, the uh, helping with the threes, helping with the mid-range, the uh, one-on-ones, full-court, stuff like that. Nah, man. Just cancel all that out. As soon as somebody asks you a question,